A week later, the Barbenheimer boom has not abated. Seven days after Greta Gerwig's Barbie and Christopher Nolan's Oppenheimer conspired to set box office records, the two films held unusually strongly in theaters. Barbie took in a massive US$93 million in its second weekend, according to studio estimates Sunday. Oppenheimer stayed in second with a robust US$46.2 million. Sales for the two movies dipped 43% and 44%, respectively well shy of the usual week two drops. Barbenheimer has proven to be not a one-weekend phenomenon but an ongoing box office bonanza. The two movies combined have already surpassed US$1 billion in worldwide ticket sales. Paul Dergrabedian, senior media analyst for data firm Comsco, call it a touchstone moment for movies, moviegoers, and movie theaters. Having two movies from rival studios linked in this way and both boosting each other's fortunes both box office-wise and in terms of their profile I don't know if there is a comp for this in the annals of box office history said Doug Rabidian. There is really no comparison for this. Following its year-best US$162 million opening, the pink-infused pop sensation of Barbie saw remarkably sustained business through the week and into the weekend. The film outpaced Nolan's The Dark Knight to have the best first 11 days in theatres of any Warner Bros. release ever.